Hello guys, Crispy here and welcome back to another video. In this one, my friends, I'm going to be testing a GeForce GT 710 2GB DDR3 in Resident Evil Village. Yes, my friends, I told you in the last video that I couldn't really make the GT 710 work in this game because it doesn't natively support DirectX 12 and the game was uh, just not launchable even. But somebody told me to install these very old drivers from 2016, 368.81, and the game now works. So uh, I guess it's either NVIDIA or the game developers that don't really allow the 700 series to work in this game. I will be testing the GTX 780 and 780 Ti in the future as well, just to see if those are capable of running this. But anyways, we're running it with a Ryzen 9 5900X and 32GB of RAM to avoid any CPU bottlenecks or RAM bottlenecks. Of course, you don't need these specs to achieve the same FPS as in this video, and you should not buy this game if you have a GT710. Okay, so I have already set everything I could to the minimum uh, settings in this game 1080p resolution uh, this is gonna take a while I'm gonna fast forward wait, wait wait can we disable ambient occlusion yes we can why wasn't it disabled I don't know but that's it guys that's it 1080p Minimum settings. So we're here. I oh, how am I gonna do this? How am I gonna? Oh my gosh. How am I gonna run away from them if I can't even move my mouse properly? I I'm pressing V by the way to view objectives and stuff, and I can't do anything. Oh my god. Hello, dude. How's it going? Are you a thumbnail, buddy? I'm pressing V. I want to see of ob the objectives and it's black. My guy should be running at this moment and run for, your life. run for your life. See that? But no, no, I can't run. Or if it's if he's running, I can't really tell he's running. The good thing is the game engine actually breaks whenever you're below 30 FPS, so uh, we might be capable of doing something here. I don't know. So far, so horrible. <laughs> Hi, buddy. How's it going? What the hell is going on? What is that? Uh. Can I? No, I should probably not go this way, right? <laughs> you know what? This is a little bit more chill, definitely. When I was playing with the 1660 Ti yesterday, going through this area right here, it was actually kind of scary and stuff. And now it's just a walk in the park. Very Look nice at that. <laughs> you can appreciate the details and stuff. Yeah, it's a slow motion experience. It's amazing! It's very playable! You should definitely not buy this game. Oh, hello there! You dropped from the sky like an angel, buddy. It was so smooth and so slow and beautiful. You know, let's skip it. Yeah, skip, skip, okay, okay. You know, at least we're getting like 6 to 8 FPS consistently, so it's, it's a consistent experience, it's not stuttering. Uh, hi! Oh yes, now that thing is coming down i have no idea what to do oh wait oh wait i can go through there right yeah this is very similar to the other thing uh there it is all right examine see friends this is how you examine things come on see please okay no 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 see again go go thank you thank you oh more things beautiful spikes everywhere and stuff this is awesome. Okay, can I go through here? Probably not. Yeah, that's not a good idea. Let's go, Ethan. All good. It's all fine. What the hell? <laughs> My word. You truly are as strong as they say. Should I stop now? Yeah, you know what? I am sorry, guys. This... I am actually playing the game. You know, this is weird. Because usually it would be a, an awful experience. But... I'm playing it. Everything in, is in slow motion with me. I can do it, <laughs> kind of. <laughs> oh, man. All right, guys, we're now at the 720p resolution, 1280 by 720, still utilizing the same settings. I didn't change anything here, not even the image quality setting. We're going to touch that in a little bit, though. And we gained about what? 4 FPS, maybe? I don't really remember how many we were getting here, but uh, it's, it's becoming playable. Slowly but surely. 
not really i'm just joking you know it's it's horrible still um it, it's probably even worse now because it, it's in less slow motion can you break it please i'm pressing it oh god i think i'm gonna die guys oh 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 okay uh so this is the grand finale i think what should i do oh boy i am screwed i am completely screwed please climb something or s oh boy no no dude come on <laughs> i don't really have time to is that a passage no uh is this no come on i'm fine it's all good it's all good ethan it's all good i'm good oh Oh, you're you're a smart boy, aren't you? <laughs> All right. Like fresh American ground beef. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm not dead. I am not dead. I'm so happy I'm not dead. Okay. All right. Come on. It just stopped. We're good. We're alive. So they think that I'm dead, I believe. And now I'm actually free. Oh, look at those beautiful muddy textures. To be honest, Ethan, I don't really care about Rose. I just want to get out of here. She's gone by now, okay? Oh, more spikes? Come on! Why are there so many spikes still? Ah, okay, this is so slow, by the way. I wish I could run or something, but... Maybe he is actually running, I don't know. It's funny, because with the 1660 Ti, I instantly died. But now with the GT710, I, I had time to see things around me and stuff. It gives you an advantage. Maybe that's why they don't allow you to play this game with it. <laughs> Unless you're running drivers from five years ago. <laughs> yeah, boy, I missed those eight FPS so much. This is so much better now. Seven, crazy good, friends. We're finally in a demanding area, sort of. It's not really that demanding, but it's dropping our frames by quite a bit. Um, so, that's the experience at somewhat normal resolutions to play games at. Let's drop it, shall we? <laughs> Let's set this to 0 0.5, which I believe is like 360p, and we're getting uh, pretty bad frames per second still. At least it doesn't drop to 7 anymore. We got two more frames there. Amazing. And now the game looks like crap, of course. At least we get more FPS, right? FPS are everything. We're almost getting that competitive experience here in Resident Evil Village. Wow, look at this amazing looking castle. So beautiful. Should I continue playing like this? Actually dropped into the sevens again. Uh, we're probably going inside now, so that's good. Uh, I've been no, waiting not for yet. You, Mr. Winter. Oh, it's the yeah, fat guy, okay. <laughs> yeah, that's his belly, all right. I think this guy's friendly, so we should be fine. Why are you here and why are you helping me? That's my real question, you know, but let's just skip it. Actually, showing you cutscenes is probably better for me because then I don't really have to play the game. <laughs> I pressed F. Okay, finally, it loaded. Um, I could use a weapon. Well, never mind. I got 760 leish. You know what? This is still horrible. Yeah, there we go. It's at 640 by 480. There you can see it, but we're still utilizing the 0 0.5 image quality setting there. So this is actually closer, if not 240p resolution. Yeah. So at 240p, absolute lowest settings in this game. This is actually... My mouse is actually showing up. <laughs> Interesting. This is actually kind of looking like the first Resident Evil games, you know, those on the PS1 and stuff. Very interesting, and it's still getting the same crappy FPS, of course, because the 710 always has to disappoint us. Now, the problem is that the VRAM is really, really slow. It's, the GPU usage is not even maxing out right now. Um, yeah, 0% CPU usage, they're amazing stuff. <laughs> But yeah, as the VRAM is so slow in this GPU and we don't really have enough of it, it runs like this. Yeah, it's it's using 1.5 gigs or 1.6 gigs of VRAM, which indicates that it's, silly. it's enough, you know, but 
Oh, 20 FPS. Look at that. Amazing. People have told me that 4 gigabytes of VRAM is definitely needed in this game. 3 gigabytes as a minimum. And, well, the game is completely horrible and unplayable like this. 8 FPS at times. That's been it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope I made it clear that you shouldn't buy this GPU or this game with this GPU. 6 frames per second. 6 frames per second at 240p. Crazy. Thank you very much for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll catch you in the next one very soon, hopefully. As always, I love you all. Bye-bye.